What price tag would you put on your waste? Every year, around 2 billion tons of organic waste is produced worldwide. Cities all over the world are growing exponentially, especially in emerging economies, and it only worsens the problem of poor waste management. In fast-growing cities, over 60% of the waste is organic, which notably includes food waste, kitchen waste, or sanitation waste. And that's very true for a place like Nairobi, where over 2 k tons of organic waste is disposed every day in open dumps or landfills. The lack of affordable infrastructure for sanitation and solid waste management directly contributes to a rise of greenhouse gas emissions, an increase of polluted waters, and consequently health issues, especially in low-income neighborhoods. Adding to that, like many fast-growing cities, Nairobi doesn't produce enough food. Agricultural yields and soil fertility are declining as the intensity of agriculture increases. The demand for livestock is high, but the availability of quality protein for animal feed is low, which translates into reduced income for farmers, deforestation and overfishing. As cities expand rapidly, local and national governments struggle to address these issues. Meet Synergy, a company based in Nairobi, Kenya, dedicated to transform the way booming cities manage their waste turning organic and sanitation waste into high-quality agriculture and energy products. Sanergy safely collects 150 tons a day of organic waste from municipal, commercial, sanitary and agricultural sources across Nairobi. All the waste is then safely transported by trucks to this large-scale processing plant outside the city in order to be converted into three valuable inputs. The first one is an insect-based protein for animal feed. To produce it, Sanergy raises a species called black soldier fly larvae, a type of fly which eats organic matter in abundance. Once they get big and fat, they are harvested, pasteurized, dried, and 40% of it can be used as a tasty protein for animals by livestock farmers and feed millers. The insects leave behind a residue called frass, which is composed into a nutrient-rich organic fertilizer, Sanergy's second project. This organic fertilizer increases crop yield by about 30%, soil fertility, water use efficiency, and ultimately income for smallholder farmers. The remaining frass is compressed to form biomass briquettes, the third main product of Sanergy, which can notably be used by local factories Factories as a sustainable fuel or an alternative to timber, replacing polluting energy sources and avoiding deforestation. Sanergy's circular economy model allows to directly tackle the global challenge of waste management in booming cities while empowering smallholder farmers and reducing negative impacts on the environment. As of today, Sanergy removes over 50,000 tons of waste every year from the Arabi. In the next five years, Sanergy expects to collect 1 million tons of waste annually benefiting 50k farmers and offsetting half a million tons of CO2. Synergy has already expanded in five Kenyan cities and is expected to launch in more than six countries between 2022 and 2024. Synergy is currently the most recognized waste management company in Nairobi, in addition to being the largest domestic producer of organic fertilizer and insect-based protein in Kenya. What else can you think of to turn waste into value? Time to be creative. That's a wrap for today. Stay tuned for the next episode.